right guys, so about three weeks ago I noticed my ABS light and my traction control light on my dashboard were coming on intermittently uh, throughout the day. Uh, then after a few days it stayed on constantly. I also noticed my cruise control uh, didn't work uh, when the lights were on. So I did some research online and what it boils down to is the ABS speed sensor in the rear tires of the truck. You have one on each side. Um, I don't know which one is bad, but they're cheap enough online. I, I, I noticed them between $18 and $25, somewhere in that range. I picked up two of them. Um, you're better off just changing them both if they're cheap enough. Um, because if one's going bad, you, the other one's bound to be right behind it. So let me show you how to change them. And it's very, it's really simple and uh, hopefully that will be the fix for my truck. All right, so this is the rear tire of my truck. That's the rear end right there. So we need to go in the front of the rear tires. And see if I can squeeze under here. Okay guys, this is the ABS speed sensor right here. Uh, you just disconnect this and this is the plug here and this little screw here you just unscrew this and this whole system comes sliding out of here and we'll put the new one in plug it back in tighten this up and we'll do that to both sides okay we are ready to take this off you need to first move this red clip back like that. And then we need to finagle this thing out of here. Uh, easier said than done, huh? I think it's coming. There we go. Okay, so take, move this red clip up and then it'll it'll come out it's going to take some finagling and wiggling but it'll come off okay now now we're ready to take off the um, the screw there and that is an eight millimeter if i can get that on there there we go yep. Now we gotta try to get it out. That was easy enough. And that's the old one. And now we'll replace it with the new one. And here's the new one. And we'll tighten that up. That's good. Put the plug back on. And push this back down. Now let's make, make sure this plug is in. There. All the way, it's got to click all the way down. And then this will, will be pushed back down and we're good to go now. So we got one replaced, I got one more to go. All right guys, the moment of truth. 
Take the ignition in. Now, it should disappear. Oh, it's completely gone. Oh, I thought I'd have to drive it for a little bit. Okay, so you see here no more uh, traction control, no more ABS light on this side. We are good to go. All right, guys, that is about it. You've seen how easy that was. You just take that little eight millimeter screw off, unplug everything, pull it out, and put the new one in, and then put everything back, and um, you should be all set. All right, guys, so I hope you found this video useful. It should have saved you a couple hundred dollars uh, compared to bringing your car in to get it serviced. Um, so thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share, and I greatly appreciate it. Thank you. Mm -hmm.